Hey guys, what is going on? It is Deboki here once again, and it is time for Maple Monday. It is Monday, May 7th, 2012, and it is another glorious Monday. Happy Monday, everyone. I hope you guys are enjoying this Monday so far, and hope you guys will have a great week. I am very excited to go through the Maple Monday submissions from last week. You guys submitted me a lot of things, and I might just take one whole Monday someday in the future just to show off all the submissions, because of course, I can't show off all the submissions. I just don't have the time. So maybe some Monday I'll go ahead and go through all of your guys' submissions. So we got submissions to go through as well as some news, events, updates, and so forth. Just Maple Story Talk. Um, of course, the month is May. Happy May, everyone. And you guys know that Maple Story started in May. So I hope you guys will all be enjoying the anniversary out there. The seventh anniversary for GMS. It will be exciting. And sadly, I will be in Korea this whole month of May, so I will not be able to enjoy the GMS um, anniversary. But you guys can do it for me and send me your screenshots and videos on how much fun you guys are having this month on Maple Anniversary. I'll go ahead and release some more details later on in this video about what is going to happen to my Maple Mondays while I'm in Korea. So just stay tuned for that. But now it is time to go through some Maple Monday submissions. So we're going to go ahead and just start here. Let me go ahead and look at my folder. I haven't really uh, decided what to show first, but I do have some chosen. So definitely, guys, we're going to go ahead and get right into it. Let's try to go into some order. Let's see here. First submission goes to Chris. Chris submitted this excellent drawing of Tammy and I. Uh, we are here in this heart bubble. I love it when you guys submit me drawings because, well, it takes a lot of skill, determination. It's really personal, you know, drawings. And it's this is really awesome. So Tammy X Chan is my girlfriend. She is there on the left, or it depends which side, which way you're looking at the computer screen. But it's to my left, to my right is Debo King. That is me, Tammy and Dave Forever. Little adorable pink bean pet and my little bunny. Thank you very much, Chris, for submitting that picture. I enjoyed it greatly. So next, we are going to go ahead and go to my good friend, Ariel. He actually submitted a picture of himself soloing Von Leon. Now, a picture is a thousand words, as you can see here. It is not a video, but we do know exactly what is going on. A coin just dropped, as you can see in the middle of the screen. The timer is 54 minutes and 59 seconds, so you guys know what that means. He soloed Von Leon in five minutes. His IGN is Ben's Mercedes, and you can find him in Kiny. So if you see him, congratulate him on his soloing five-minute Von Leon, because that that is incredible because Von Leon spawns so many mobs. Very, very frustrating to try to solo that thing, but Ariel did it like a boss. He is a Mercedes. Thank you, Ariel, for submitting that picture. And next, we'll go ahead and look at... Do, 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 do. What shall we look at? We will look at another drawing by Kenny. Kenny drew his friend a battle mage or a some sort of mage. Um, the thing is, you guys say that I don't show enough mage love on my channel. Well, here you guys go. I'm trying to implement it here and there. Um, this guy, Mystic Chain, apparently got falsely accused for hacking. So he drew a picture of his friend trying to just to support him. As you can see here, he's got the dark foreshadow on his face holding the Ellie wand. And he's got some cool shorts on which I envy greatly because I love a good pair of shorts so thank you Kenny for submitting that Eric you've probably seen him in my last video he submitted a pretty cool comic but if you forgot who he was here is another drawing by Eric he submitted Maple Monday um, <laughs> Maple Monday is on the top right obviously the title Eric he drew he redrew my profile picture which is pretty cool my profile picture was originally drawn by Christina if you guys didn't know but Eric redrew it greatly thank you Eric for that it took a lot of time and effort those drawings are not easy trust me those I've tried to draw Maple Story characters before it came out to look like stick figures not good Maple Story with stick figures not a good combination next drawing goes to Ryan he actually drew me and this is, if you guys don't know where this is, this is actually my famous AFK spot, the Elnath Pot Shop. AFKing there always. You guys are like, Deboki, why are you always AFKing? Well, it's because I am busy. And I am away from the keyboard. So it's a logical excuse to be AFKing. But anyway, this is me. You know, as you can see, I am in my boxers. That is definitely Deboki style. Got my crossbow there. I am shooting all over the Elnath Pot Shop. Um, actually, I guess this picture is not me AFKing since I am shooting. Unless I have some sort of hack on that allows me to shoot while AFK. 
And uh, this pot shop owner is saying, David, you're scaring away all the customers. Um, I should be because the El Nath pot shop is not for customers. It is for AFKers. So customers, get out of there. Thank you, Ryan, for submitting that picture. It is awesome. Next, we're going to look at Angeline. Um, she submitted a picture. Someone, as you notice in the top of the map, mini map there, she circled it greatly. Someone is flying and dropping mesos. You know, that is excellent. This is what I want to see more. Hackers giving back to the community. See, see how he's dropping diligently the mesos through the Henesis crowded market? That is like Robin Hood right there. He steals from the rich, which is Nexon, and he gives back to the poor, which is us maplers, um, except hacking, of course, is not acceptable. So hacker equals bad, but I like his efforts trying to give back to the community by throwing mesos on the ground even though it's only 10 mesos or however much he is throwing it's a thought that counts thank you angeline for showing sharing and showing that excellent screenshot the next flying picture goes to don i thought that he meant that he was flying off of his jaguar but apparently if you look closely at the top left corner of the screen there is someone that is flying named sark moy Ars. He thought he could get away, but he was caught by Mr. Don. His feet were shown in the picture. GG, no re, Mr. Sark, you are out of here. Um, next picture, very good, good, good picture by Tyler. He drew his girlfriend, um, Karina. This is Tyler and Karina. This is their Maple Story avatar, which is really cool. They are kissing. As you noticed, the two lips are intertwining with each other, just in case if you guys did not know what that was. Um, this is a very good picture. I really liked it. A lot of time, the coloring, the shadowing, the shading. I'm not an art major, but you know what? I can tell that that is a pretty good drawing. So apparently they met on MapleStory. Hear this story. He sent me a little story by this. Tyler met his girlfriend on MapleStory, right? Just like I met Tammy. But the thing is, they were training on MP3 maps. They met, they started talking, but then... After they started talking, they realized they were in the same Japanese class in college. Isn't that crazy? They were in the same school the whole time, and they met each other on MapleStory first, and then they're like, whoa, wait a second, we are we know each other in real life? Okay, that's cool. That is pretty cool. So Tyler and Karina, I'm happy for you guys. They are still happily in love and dating. Kudos to you guys. That is pretty cool. Nana submitted me a very interesting video of a pig flying in Pig Beach Hidden Street area. Now, this video was very interesting. Well, first of all, she took it probably with her phone or some sort of camera, and she took the picture or the phone with a computer screen as you can see the quality but you can definitely tell that there is a pig jumping up and down in the map now i don't know if what we're supposed to call this but either the pig is hacking or nexon is hacking or nana is just in some mystical world that we must help her and save her from nana thank you very much for taking the time her ign is also polar bear cutie that's a Q and the T. Um, so that is pretty cool, cool video. I enjoy that. Now to start to get into the Minecraft submissions. I've noticed you guys have been sending me a lot of Minecraft submissions, which I love. The first Minecraft submission will go into a community, a Minecraft community. I know this has nothing MapleStory related, but he really wanted me to show this off. Um, thank you, Luis, for showing me your world. It is very cool. Very cool world. I like it. I like it a lot. Next one goes by the governor um this intro or i shouldn't say intro this video is pretty cool if you notice that he goes out from the green blocks he flips the switch tnt starts to explode everywhere the frames per second cannot keep up but notice the letters behind it yes that is right the bokeh Woo! love it love it love it love it thank you very much mr governor you are awesome for making that very last submission also goes to tim he actually made me minecraft virgin very tedious and a lot of work was put into that thank you tim but not only did he make me sit back and enjoy this video Yes, so that video was 
pretty darn sweet. I like it a lot. You guys are so creative and awesome. Um, so we're going to go ahead and get into the tip of the day, tip of the week, I should say. So you guys can go ahead and try this out this week. See if it works. Uh, Faluzu, Falazu, excuse me, Falazu. He sent me a submission um, that was a tip, actually, a tip that he found out that he actually discovered himself. So I want to see if this works, and I want you guys to experiment it out and see if it works. So it's for you miners out there. Here's Faluzu from Kaini wanting to share a small tip for crafters. I tried it myself yesterday and it looks pretty efficient. Have you ever been looking for minerals like aquamarine, diamonds, or even lithium and became tired of buying three tickets for the expert mine with all your characters? Well, it says, if I find some heart stones, maybe it'll be better. So pretty much what he did, as you can read here, that he went and he found a good map that actually spawned heart stones and he says that it actually spawns also as well the golden flowers so that is pretty cool after about 20 minutes he actually found 10 heart stones that's six star crystals 10 topaz 10 emeralds 12 aquamarines 9 diamonds 10 lithiums and 450 fragment ores and some colored powders gold plates and garnets so that is guys in boswell field one if you don't know where that is you take the the Ludi cab into Omega Sector. Remember that place where no one wanted to go? Omega Sector is like, oh, Omega Sector, that place is gross. Well, yeah. Um, Omega Sector is actually apparently where this awesome Heartstone is. So he says it's in uh, Boswell Field. Something like that. <laughs> it's something like that in parentheses. Uh, field 1. Yeah, so Boswell Field 1. And you'll go ahead and hopefully find these Hearthstones. So let me know, guys, if that works out. Because I didn't have time to try it out. But apparently he did. And it works. So that will save a lot of time. That is pretty cool. Alright, so kind of a funny story relating to Omega Sector and Boswell. When I was reading that, I just remembered actually something that happened to me a long, long time ago in Omega Sector. We all have, it seems like we most of us have these stories with Omega Sector. Because we have adventures in Omega Sector. My adventure was not too good. Um, well, actually it was kind of. But so a long time ago, when I just first started Maple Story, about like five years ago or so, um, my brother actually, he got me into Maple Story. He started me off. And I was um, my little character, low level character, little petite Clementine. And uh, he took me down Omega Sector. He took me down to Omega Sector. That is right. He took me down the whole Ludi Tower. We had to walk the whole way down. And he took me down to Omega Sector. And I was like, what is down here exactly? You know, this place looks pretty cool. And he's like, absolutely nothing. And I was like, why did you bring me down here? And this is what he told me. It builds character. And every mapler should experience this feeling and i was like what feeling is that aliens you know, aliens are awesome i've never seen them in maple story before i was fighting ribbon pigs and slimes all my 10 levels what am i doing down here he says david let me tell you this okay this this might blow your mind but this will build character and this will make you a pro mapler and i said all right so what are we gonna do what, what are we gonna fight what what kind of task will we achieve today and he said you are going to walk up all 100 floors of the Ludi Tower. <laughs> I looked at him and I said, I, I, didn't, I thought he was joking. I was like, 100 floors, you know, I, I'm too lazy to even count to 100. How am I supposed to walk up 100 floors in a 2D pixelated game that I just started? Do you want me to hate this game already? I was like, all right, well, you know what? It's okay. At least you and I can do it together. A brother bonding experience. Maple Story, yes. And guess what he did? He used his tower scroll, his looty tower scroll, and he shot up the tower. He teleported up the tower. He left me down there. All right, I was stuck down there for like a week. I was, cause I, I kept going up. I don't know if you remember, but like at the very bottom of the floor, I don't know why Nexon did this, but they put a very, very high level monster down there. It was called the block golems. Now these deadly creatures had me stuck down there for a week, real time week. Okay. I, I was trying to climb up and I didn't have dark sight and the block golem hit me and I died and I respawned not in Ludi, but I respawned in Omega Sector and I couldn't even get past the bottom floor. <laughs> I was raging. All right, I was raging. If someone came up to me and was like, you mad, bro? I'd be like, yes, I am mad. <laughs> so I was raging pretty hard and uh, my brother was laughing at me and I was like, I can't do this. And he's like, you can do this. And guess what? I did it. 
I bought a VIP rock in cash shop. No, I'm just kidding. I actually uh, somehow managed to give the golems a slip. I kept like hitting them and I would like jump down and they would move over to the right and I would try to run up and I'll try to do it over and it was a lot of failure. I died a lot. I was, I was down there at like level 15 or something. I don't know, but it was horrible. <laughs> guys, I want you guys to share me your experiences of Omega Sector, good or bad. If you guys like it or not, I personally hated Omega Sector and I still do today because of the fact that, well, the experience, you know, it's like a kid is afraid of broccoli because they were forced broccoli when they were a little child and because their parents were like, broccoli is good for you. And they're shoving it down the kid's throat and no wonder everyone hates vegetables when they grow up. Not you guys though, right? You guys love them because you guys are awesome, like me. I love my vegetables. <laughs> okay, I don't know why I'm talking about vegetables. What am I, a parent? All right, guys. Well, anyway, I hope you enjoyed this Maple Monday. I know there wasn't really that much going on in this episode, but like always, thank you so much for watching, guys. Keep submitting your submissions to me at my email. It's again, it's thedeboki at gmail.com. I will be in Korea this next month and a half. I will be returning on June 16th. I am leaving on May 11th. And if you guys haven't checked out my Korea video, do so now. Um, it's just pretty much details of me going to Korea. But I will try to release maple monday videos while i'm in korea i don't know how that's gonna work but of course it won't be any like footage it'll just mostly be your guys' submissions as well as um maybe some maple story things i find in korea so that'll be pretty fun so guys thank you so much for watching this has been naboki and happy monday